Apple Bouncing Cherry Flavored Explosive Candies with Bunny Ears! I'm Winter, and I'm going to introduce you to this game called... Look at the title of the video, Cuppy Kitty! It's a short description that I can give you. I can say that it has explosions, robots, bunnies and penguins. So it's awesome. That's all you need to know. It's a longer description. We're going to be introduced to the game by a tutorial the very first time you start up the game and there is no save file already. So that, that is going to bring you to the tutorial even before it's going to uh, bring you to the <laughs> main screen. That's, uh, I suppose that's fine. And this is how the game looks when you actually play it, you're inside of it. Uh, there is a tiny bit of story, this is where the main, the main character is a uh, cat, human, alien thingy called Bucky. And uh, I am going <laughs> to probably mispronounce the name of uh, every single character and the creature in this game because they are all really weird. This is our uncle and uh, he has gotten as uh, this uh, software that he made himself. It's a virtual reality kind of uh, video game, sort of. A military training program, as she called it. We have the ability to double jump and we have the ability to shoot. This is our main weapon. So it's a little shooter platformer with a little twist that we're going to see in a moment. Uh, I need however to change my settings here at the moment I can figure out how to because uh, I prefer a different kind of control. There are two, whoops, that was the wrong button. There are two different kind of uh, controls and I pre prefer this one. You can have a maximum of three weapons at a time. For now we only have the default one which is this little gun thingy. And if you look in the upper left corner, that's uh, our three weapons. For now we have none, so we only have the default one. I ch just changed the settings so that I would have a, a key, a button to press for each weapon. So if I want to shoot with the one on the far left, I have a button to shoot and with the... And I have three different buttons for each weapon. Otherwise, you have the ability to uh, scroll between them. So again, we have a double jumping and we have little enemies to shoot them with... Oh, that thing is following me with our default weapon thingy and when you defeat enemies they might drop their own weapon which you can pick up uh, and use for yourself as you can see this one is called force and uh, it's uh, like this a tiny bit stronger than the what we had before we have ability to kick and that's awesome because you can kick walls you can't kick these ones uh, they are like I don't know <laughs> bad joke there we go <laughs> And so you can play around with the scenery too. Now we have to kick this wall here to proceed and shoot this other enemy. Now we got another weapon which I'm going to use with this little button. I'm using a joystick right now. Every single key in this game can be rebounded to a different one which is great and you can use a controller with it. We are getting a weapon called Bounce and here's where you start seeing where this game is going. Bounce is a little weapon that bounces all over the place. <laughs> That's ouch, that thing hurt me. So we have to hit the target down there, boop, to open the wall and keep progressing. There's more weapons here. Now we're going to see what the awesome thing about this game is. And the awesome thing is the ability to combine weapons. There is, a, I'm not sure, maybe a dozen of weapons right now in this game. But you can combine them two or three at a time to have a single weapon that, ouch, that still hurt me. <laughs> a single weapon that has all the abilities of the weapons you currently have combined. So let's try to get that target. Let's see. Can I hit it like this? Uh, I am incapable of hitting it like that. So let's try. Maybe I just need to split. How is... Okay, split was enough, actually. Rolling is by made by jumping and looking down. What's the jump button? What's the jump button? There we go. <laughs> I am still very rusty with this because I haven't played in ages. Uh, this is a much newer version than what I'm used to, but uh, the concept is still the same. And this is ours. This is so beautiful. Just uh, <laughs> look how colorful and amazing this game can be. There's so much you can do, and it's always going to surprise you with the results of commanding weapons. Uh, I believe with all the basic weapons that you have in this game, you can have uh, something like uh, hundreds of uh, different results by commanding them. That is the 
core of the game, you shoot at things and uh, you get their weapons and you combine them to get even more weapons that look uh, and play even more awesomely. So, for being an indie game that is currently in beta and uh, is can be downloaded and played for free, it has a ridiculous amount of depth. And I love it. I haven't played it for a long while, uh, ever since I had the uh, DDDD older computer and I always plan it to so I guess that this is now time to make a little let's play that is at the same time sort of blind and sort of not because <laughs> I don't remember anything about this but uh, I know enough to explain uh, what's going on this doesn't feel like a beta at all it I haven't ever come across the issues of any kind the game not behaving like it should only problem I have with it uh, is that I can't even show it because you can't change the resolution in-game. You can only do that uh, when you start the game in a different window. The resolutions that you have at your disposal are all weird. The reason the default that I record and upload videos at, so the screen is going to be a tiny bit... Uh, it's not going to be full and it's going to have a tiny bit of border, but uh, we have to deal with it. Let's introduce the game itself we have two main modes one is endless one is mission mode mission mode has a bunch of missions and the objective is to defeat certain enemies or destroy certain targets while oh, i actually wanted to go back but i guess we can do that <laughs> here let's take a look at the little guys with the or the, you know, destroy around them are the ones you are supposed to destroy while the other ones you don't have to kill them to defeat the... to win the mission. Here we have gotten a weapon, it's force again, so let's uh, remember how to shoot in the first place and also how to jump over things. Weapons will be used up, uh, they have a durability, if you look at the little bar in the upper left corner it's being used up, you also have a number above your head, that is uh, also the durability, this is health, and these are targets, which may or may not drop things. Uh, force is a very basic attack that just goes in a straight line. Quick uh, is pretty neat because you can keep it pressed and it will keep on shooting. So if you combine quick with force, the result is pretty much a force that you can keep constantly shooting. So it's all very intuitive, it plays really nicely, you don't have... you, you can... It's one of those games that you learn immediately and uh, yet you can... you have to master over time. The, o the other mod... how do I go back? Uh, <laughs> the other mod is Endless Mode, which is a single level that, you guessed it, keeps going on over and over forever and forever and keeps generating itself and new enemies until... until you can handle it. So <laughs> Plus it has a level editor, it has a bunch of... Uh, Things, uh, art gallery, database, sound test, but uh, replays. This game actually can record uh, on its own uh, the things you do. I don't believe it's still yet perfect, but you, if you want to upload a video of a mission that you have uh, defeated, you don't even have to have a recording software. It, this game is capable of uh, recording your own battles on its own. I don't know what else you could possibly want from a video game. This is colorful, pretty, Deep, you get to pick uh, in some missions uh, a starting weapon if you want, or you can go without one. So I'll gladly take Wave so I can show it to you. Wave, uh, I think uh, should be. No, it's not. Uh, I don't remember what Wave is. <laughs> We're going to explore this game a tiny bit together. Hmm. I had just to destroy targets. Oh, yeah, this is the first mission. It really doesn't ask you anything else but to destroy stuff. Uh, the stuff down here will hurt you, so if you jump in it, you're going to take damage. Talking about taking damage, there is a, a beeping sound kind of thing that actually goes with the music that will warn you when you have low HPs, Pokemon style, which actually can be disabled in the options if you don't like it, so that's pretty too. Oh, light! Light is my favorite weapon, I mean, just look at it. Boom! <laughs> How can you not like this? And careful not to get hurt. First the missions are of course easier and as you progress through the game they get more complicated and difficult. And you will have to get more and more creative to defeat them. Bounce and light 
will make a bouncing lightning. <laughs> it's that simple, see? It's very intuitive. And whenever there are two weapons that you have that don't really have a way to combine normally, they'll just make a new and uh, even more amazing uh, kind of result. Uh, so you, <laughs> this game will constantly keep surprising you, which is just incredible. We are gone through the next uh, mission, so we keep going. Every mission is a hard mode and a normal mode. Oh, that wasn't uh, how I like, hit stuff. Oh, did I show you can jump on things and I missed that one. You can jump and kick their kick them in their heads. Ow, okay, I'm not <laughs> doing too well. That one is some sort of fire weapon. I want it. Give it to me. Thank you very much. Oh, it's a shield thingy. Not sure what it does actually. But I'll take it. Oh! Oh, that was awesome. I don't know what I just did, but it was awesome. I got the power kick. The power kick goes BAM! Let's use it. Boom! <laughs> uh, I am out of weapons. I'll gladly take the one with... Ouch! Down here. Can I take it? There we go. Force! And this is Tornado. Tornado is a vertical weapon that goes directly upward through things. So of course, when you combine it with other things, uh, it will allow you to hit stuff that is directly above you in pretty impressive ways. Look at that. Force plus tornado plus wave. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Let's keep going. I believe I'll... Don't know. Uh, I'll make 15 minutes episodes every time. Let's start with tornado. There we go. This is a very nice place to test uh, how tornado works. Let's mix it with this one, that's plasma, plasma plus tornado equals... Ah, incredible awesomeness! Ah, plasma tornado, boom! <laughs> Can I add that? Thank you. Bounce, bounce, tornado, plasma, beam! <laughs> Bouncing all over the screen. <laughs> See, we managed to eat that guy even though we couldn't break through the wall with by using tornado. There is so much depth to this, I... Ah... <laughs> And this is a boss battle! Boom! Already won! Or mostly. This is an enemy you're going to see a lot in this game. It's pretty cool, it's pretty hard to defeat, especially with no special weapons whatsoever. Right now I'm just jumping with... <laughs> just jumping on his head. Ouch, I don't get too close clearly, it's a terrible idea. It's going to shoot something horrifying. Oh, and that title is following me, so let's try to avoid it. Alright, it's gone. Ouch, get the bucket beam in the face, boom, and more kicks. Ow, that really hurts. Boom, and now that we are defeated it, what could be the most... Uh, what would be a better reward than to be able to climb with this thing and drive it for ourselves? Like, <laughs> it's very slow, but uh, it's awesome. It, it does exactly the same attacks as the it, it does on its own. Uh, let's see what I can do. Oink. What does this do? Oh, this is the big weapon. Kapow! <laughs> the jump can be charged so you can reach higher areas, even though they, they're like this. Boom! And now let's destroy everybody in this room! Pew, 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 pew. I'm missing this. There we go. This is the kick button, see? And this is our default weapon. Every once in a while it's going to shoot the red things uh, all together like that and I have to get that key down there can I I can't uh, kick downwards uh, or punch downwards with my huge claw and there is another one the fight of the titans let me just uh, slap you <laughs> oh my health is already pretty low I have been destroyed and now my own health is low careful oh dear there we go ah ah <laughs> I mean, it will end up being destroyed this way. Nope, I did it. Hooray! That level was stupid. No, it was amazing. Rather sinister. This, this dialogue... I don't remember it. It is new. <laughs> and that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed yourself and I will see you... Ooh, this is going to be great, I will see you in the next episode of Copy Kitty!